Hi there, Neil Clark here from Falkirk Piping, www.falkirkpiping.com. Welcome to the channel. Videos contained here are designed as aid memoirs for my pupils, although they're free for anyone to use. If you're benefiting from the videos, please subscribe to the channel. This is completely free to do. May I also ask that you consider supporting my chosen charity, Parkinson's UK, by donating to my Just Giving page. The link to that page may be found in the comments box below this video. Today is... Sunday the 22nd of August 2021 and this is day 22 of the Piping 100 Challenge. I always try and, uh, if I'm outside, well I'm supposed to be outside today but it's raining again, Graham. Uh, so I, I always try and link in the tunes with the, the location we're going to or uh, some other story. Today's tune, the missus doesn't know this yet, today's tune is the Cock of the North. And you'll be glad to hear that I'm not really going to link that in with anything personal. However, the, uh, the Cock of the North, I believe, refers to as the nickname of the Duke of Gordon, I think. Either that or his son, the Marquis of Huntley. So, uh, that's what the tune's all about. Very, very old, very famous tune. Lots of uh, very strange words to it as well. Uh, famously played, so rumour has it, by Piper George Finlater on the heights of Dargai in Afghanistan. One of the times we got a kick in in Afghanistan uh, while his uh, comrades, he was shot in both legs, propped himself up against a rock and played this tune while his comrades stormed the heights and took the hill. Uh, that's argued. If you ever read uh, George MacDonald's Fraser's books, the McCausland books, all about his actual time in the army. Uh, it's it's disputed whether or not uh, George Findlater did in fact play that tune, but it's sort of uh, agreed by regimental custom in the Gordon Highlanders that that's what he did. So, uh, the cock of the north. Okay. 